you wondering why there's no one around? It's because the reserve is officially closed to visitors for the foreseeable future. And definitely conducting emergency field research, we said. If that's what it takes to get the day trippers to clear out for a hot minute, so be it. I swear I haven't seen this place so deserted in about ten years. Ah, it's lovely, actually. Even if I can only experience it through you. We used to camp out here when I was little. Tramp over from the other side. Me and a gaggle of other kids carrying backpacks bigger than our whole bodies. Don't fall in now. Wouldn't be the first time that's happened here. Not much of that lifestyle left these days. I miss it sometimes. That'll do. It's looking well. We had some hoon try to saw off one of the branches a few weeks ago. Can you believe? But well, luckily someone managed to talk him out of it. Sometimes wedding parties will have the brides come up and sit on it. Wade right into the water and soak those dear dresses. That tree is 80 years old. Started off as a stray branch nailed to a fence. It's a tribute to tenacity if you ask me. Right, now for our next destination. Head down to the shoreline. There's a set of huge boulders there that have to be seen to be believed. I know what you're thinking. She's showing me some rocks. But trust me on this one. Our beaches are buzzing with natural activity. At least they used to be. You get more and more rubbish washed up all over the place lately. You know, bits of plastic pallets run off from factories further north. I swear I've seen tin cans with Australian brand names. We do our best, but we can't always prevent the poor critters ending up with junk in their bellies. Anyway, that's the situation. I'll get back to you when you arrive. Just going to head off for a minute and make some tea. Oh, well, look at this. Couldn't help themselves, could they? One last hurrah before we shut the place down. This really can't wait, mate. There's a little blue penguin population nesting not far from here, and they'll gladly take this for food. OK, that looks manageable. Let's clean this up and take the photo. Then we can talk hunting again.